world's largest pasta maker in decidedly hot water for some controversial comments made by its chairman. Barilla now getting heat and facing a boycott because the boss said he would never use a gay couple in ads. It sent the social media universe into an absolute firestorm yesterday. ABC's Paula Ferris has the story. With natural if you've protein, ever cooked spaghetti, Barilla pasta cooks right every time. Chances are you've had one of these iconic blue boxes in your cabinet. The choice of Italy. But this morning, Barilla, one of the world's leading makers of pasta, is finding itself in hot water after the head of the family-owned company told an Italian radio station his company would not feature same-sex families in its ads, saying that if gay customers don't like it, they can, quote, eat someone else's pasta. Guido Barilla says the backbone of his 136-year-old brand is its family image. Papa! which he defined as a husband, wife, and children. Within hours, anger on social media reached a boiling point. Model Chrissy Teigen, the wife of singer John Legend, tweeted, yikes, bye-bye, me using Barilla. And this morning, a Twitter hashtag for a boycott is trending worldwide. A statement like this is made. On the other side of the world, it becomes a controversy within a matter of minutes. At the speed of a tweet, uh, it becomes a controversy. The pasta powerhouse eclipses half a billion dollars a year in U.S. sales alone, which could now be affected. Something like this doesn't happen in a vacuum these days. All of which means, without an apology, those comments could now cost Barilla a pretty penny. For Good Morning America, Paula Ferris, ABC News, New York. Many are eager to see what is going to happen with the bottom line uh, with when, all this. When, this. when this hit social media yesterday, when, it lit up. It broke Twitter, and rightfully so. All right.